So welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Thanks a lot for joining me. My name's Mac. I hope you're doing very well. Um, so I thought I'd just take a little look at the map um, just to show you sort of what we're going to be doing in the next couple of episodes. So our camp's just over there. That's Clemens Point. So we're settling in nicely to the new camp. And the big master plan to rob both the richest families in this area, the Greys and the Braithwaites, is well in motion. So at the minute, we're just here, just on the uh, Kamasa River. Uh, so we've got John just south of us, uh, who's at the Grey's place. And then we've got Hosea over in the Braithwaite Manor. So I think what we'll do is we'll head to the nearest one. We'll go and see John Marston and uh, see what we can do to um, rob the Grey's. So what we'll do is we'll head off and uh, we will see when we're a bit nearer. And you're helping everybody. And everywhere there's troubles. And have you met my partner, Arthur Morgan? No. I met your son, the sheriff. Okay. Mr. Gray here was saying how he had problems with a family. A family of degenerates. Oh, well, nobody likes degenerates. The hag and her inbred sons. They ruined this county. They killed my uncle, you know. That ain't right. Problem is, we can't be seen to get too close. And? We got gold, Yankee. We've got gold. I ain't no Yankee, friend. I ain't nothing. My daddy came over on the boat from Scotland. I'm Scottish. And the Braithwaites? Goddamn peasants! I don't know. Mongrels! Slave fuckers! All you gotta do is look at them. How much gold? Enough. These are prized horses I'm talking about. Them they'll get you 5,000. 5,000 for horses. Easy. Where do we sell them, these $5,000 horses? Over in Clemens Cove. Oh, over there, we'll run them out of state and give you 50 cents on the dollar. Mister, you got yourself a deal. Just keep us away from this. Publicly, I mean. My sense is we keep all horse wrestling away from the public. Go to the stables on the south side of the manor. That's where they keep the thoroughbreds. Jesus, so we're going horse uh, rustling. So we're going to steal the graves for a breads. Uh, this sounds bloody good, in fact. So we've got John and Javier with us. Uh, so at least we've got a bit of backup. Uh, yeah, the Greys and the Braithwaites don't get on at all, do they? Crazy old fool. You should see the Braithwaite woman. Jose and Sean were planning on going over to the Braithwaites. You haven't seen them? No, not yet. If they're there already, they better keep their heads down. You don't need this to be any more complicated than it already is. Five thousand dollars for horses. We've been robbing the wrong folk all these years. Yeah, he doesn't know what he's talking about. But if we get even a third of that, it'll be worth it. Okay, so we're heading over to the stables. Um, I'm not sure where they are, but uh, when we're a bit nearer, we will see you there. Blasting in there. Careful, there's a guard. I'll speak to him, okay? <sighs> All right, then. Can I help you, gentlemen? Yeah, we're here to see about some horses. Horses? Yeah, we had a, an appointment with Mr. Braithwaite, I believe. Yeah, I never heard about any of this. A partner wanted to make a significant investment in some stables down here. But perhaps we should look elsewhere. Well, I... Okay then, but head on up to the stables. Oh, he's gonna regret that. Someone will come see you. I think you'll be looking for a new job, sir. Yeah. Right, okay, so we're going to rob the Braithwaite's horses. And we reckon we'll get about five grand for it. Real pile of breads. That's it. Nice and easy. No need to rush. We don't want to draw any unnecessary attention. Yeah. 
I've really enjoyed Chapter 3 because we've really got to know the other characters uh, in some detail, um, like Sadie and Lenny and Trelawney. Uh, it's been a really good chapter, this one. Uh, it's such a brilliant game, so well written. So it looks like the stables right. are just up I here. Think that's the stables just up ahead. Yeah. Heads down, play cool. Head around the front, hitch up there. Beautiful summer's evening. Just the right sort All of right. Uh, evening Let's to steal horses. Right, we'll hitch up. Let me do the talking. Go and see this guy. Just play it nice and easy. Hello there. <laughs> Can I help you boys? I hope so. Heard you got some horses. We always got horses. Fine horses, I mean. I don't get you, friend. Yeah, you do. Come on. Listen, why don't you get out of here, you Scarface and your greaser buddy? Whoa! I don't like officials. We ain't officials. We're connoisseurs looking to do some breedings. Come on now, partner. Okay, fine. Follow me. These here's mainly the studs available for purchase or for working. If that's what you're interested in. What is your boys interested in? We represent a famous uh, stable and stud farm from uh, Saratoga. Is that so? <laughs> Unofficially. Of course. This here's Cerberus. Here you go, boy. Ah, uh, greaser, huh? Beauty. Okay. Bandana's on. Don't need nobody recognizing us. All right, let's get our bandana on. Alright, I'll grab the white one in the middle, you get the other two. Relax, boy. Come on. Good boy. Whoa there. Easy. Just calm him down a little bit. Whoa. Marston, you're gonna tether him up to Javier's horse. Okay. Javier, you're gonna lead the stallions. Right, let's lead him. Okay, we give him a pat. Wait. Easy, you're all right. Right, let's lead him out. Come on, fellas, a beautiful horse. It's a bit like my new horse. Jesus, where am I going? Right, out we go. Marston, you ride point. I'll cover up the back. If there's any problems, regroup at Clemens Cove. Okay. What are you doing? Oh, it's Go gold. quick! Get going, you two! What oh, the hell are you doing? doing? Stop! Stop! Right, let's Stand sort up. these guys out. I said stop these men! Stop! Boys, let's get out of here. Clear. 
Oh, some nice uh, horses there. Oh god, ran right into a rock. Yeah. Bloody hell. You see any more of them? No? Don't think so. Alright, let's get these horses to Clemens Cove quick before we run into any more trouble. <laughs> Right, okay, so we'll head to Clemens Cove. Uh, when we're a bit nearer, we will see you there. Whoa! You're... Shit! One of the stallions is loose! Keep going! I'll get him! Yep. Right, one of them's run away. We'll just get him. Come on, fella. Damn. Yeah, we got him. Whoa! <laughs> right, we'll ride, ride him back. Yeah. Come on, fella. Right, so we got him. So we're going to head to the others. Yeah, he's a nice uh, stallion, that. We don't want to lose him. Come on, now. Hey, Morgan. Over here. Right, here's the others. You got him. Well done. Clemens Cove's just over there. Come on. Let's get this over with. Let's go. Well, that could have gone smoother. That'll be on my gravestone. <laughs> Easy. You think they look like they're paying 5000 for horses? I guess we'll see. Right, so we'll approach the rustler. Let's see by how much we get for these horses. Come here. What you boys want? Heard you was, uh, heard you pay good prices for horses. Oh, we'll buy more or less anything, Pop. That so? Sure, Pop. I'm Clay Davies. That's my brother, Clive. We're twins. John, Arthur, Javier. <clears throat> so what are you, Cuban? No, I don't like Cuban. That's so? Maybe. Well, what do you care? You ain't Cuban. Maybe I like Cubans. <laughs> Ooh, you're funny. He's funny. Ain't he funny, Clive? Clive don't talk. We're twins, but I was born first. He came out all yellow and black, but he's okay. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Yeah, I know these horses. They ain't yours, but I like you, and I'll give you... I'd give you 654. Okay. <laughs> I was told we could get up to $5,000 for them. And I was told the moon was made of ladies' tears. Only it ain't true. Not one little bit. But... I like you boys. But I ain't got more than 700 on me. You want it? Or you want to ride them fellers into town and maybe someone there will hang you? We're gonna need more than that. I ain't got no more money, Pop. Here, take it or leave it. All right. You goddamn fool, Marston. Ain't no one around here got $5,000, boys, but nice meeting you. See you boys again, I hope. Come on. Yeah. Close the gate, Clive. Believe the yarn spun us by one of that Gray family. Imagine we was going to be wonderfully rich. At the end of it, we felt like prize idiots. <laughs> yeah, so you just wonder who's playing who, really. Um, so the horses, yeah, weren't worth as much as Mr. Gray was saying. But uh, here we got $700 for it. That's not too bad. So that will go in the gang's uh, coffers. So we'll just take a little look at the map. I think we'll be heading towards the Braithwaite family next. So we're just back at camp at the minute. So we've got Hosea, yeah, Braithwaite Manor. I think we'll head to the next uh, episode. 
So I think that's where we'll leave it. So thank you so much for joining me. I really do appreciate you taking the time out to watch my videos. If you did like what you saw and you would consider subscribing, uh, that'd be absolutely bonza. But uh, until the next one, stay safe and take it easy.